Hi, I'm Marius from MS Photography and in this video we are going to talk about the compatibility of the Cactus version 6 to the older um, transceivers and triggers. So if you have say the Cactus version 2 or the version 4, now the version 2's I didn't like at all, they were terrible, they misfired a lot. That was back in 2007 and I used it on my Canon system, didn't like them. Then came out the version 4's and I love these guys, I still have two full sets of these and some extra receivers. They work great. I've got them permanently connected to my studio lights. With these, you've got your um, transmitter and you've got your receivers. They are not transceivers like the version fives and sixes. So you need to have a transmitter and a receiver. Sad thing is they are not compatible with the Cactus version sixes. Okay, so if you have the version fives, now this is called the version five DO and you get two of these version fives. Now they work exactly the same like the Cactus version six because they've got the TX and RX button here on the side. They also work on the same 2.4 gigahertz um, frequency as well as they've got the 16 channels. So these guys are compatible with your version sixes. That's the good news. So if you're already invested in the version fives, you can also use them with the version version sixes that you don't have all the features of the version version sixes i'm going to show you what you can do with them okay then you can also use your lv5 laser triggers with the version sixes so if you haven't yet um, seen what those guys can do they are awesome you can have a look at the following two videos the links are right here that's going to show you what the units uh, look like how they work and also a little shoot where i drop uh, a strawberry into water to show you the splash and how I capture it with the LV5 laser triggers. So if you haven't yet seen those videos, it's just, obviously if you watch this on YouTube, click those links and go have a look at them. Right, so how do you use the version 5s and the version 6s together? If I take, say, this um, SB800, which is now connected to the version 5, I'm going to turn this unit to RX to receive. I'm going to turn this flash on. You can't have the flash in TTL, the flash needs to be in manual. So you can't control the power levels with the version 6 when you're using the version 5. You need to put the flash in manual and then adjust the power on the, fla on the back of the flash every time you want to change the power. I'm going to put it right there, so it's flashing against the wall there. And I'm going to take this unit, the version 6, I'm going to turn it on. Now with this there are no um, groups or anything that you can control. So it's basically just triggering that thing. So the moment I press this button, you can see the flash is going off. I think I've got it set to 8th power. So now it's just flashing it every time I press this button. So if you have version 5s, bring them into the system and you can also use them to power your flash. You don't need to get rid of them. They work together. Okay, and also work the other way around. So if I turn this unit off, and um, I'm going to just, because that uh, version 5 doesn't have batteries in there, so I'm going to turn the flash off and I'm going to use this one. I'm just going to turn the, the um, button from RX to TX on the version 5. And then I've got the SB910 here. I'm going to turn this unit now to receive. So the version 6 will now be the receiver and the version 5 will now be the transmitter. So this one, i just wake up the flash here. This one I've got on manual quarter power. So every time I press the button right here, that's on the version 5, you'll see the flash is firing there every time I press the button. So this is what is compatible with the version 6s. You can use your version 5s and you can also use your LV5 laser triggers. Okay, that's all for this video. Okay, if you have enjoyed this series of videos and you're watching this on YouTube, you know what to do click that subscribe button and get all this awesome content as it comes out. Okay, so if you're interested in buying these version 6 transceivers, you can go to Camera World, details below. They're also sponsoring this entire series of videos and you can contact them direct to purchase these units. They ship throughout South Africa. For my overseas viewers watching this video, you can go to the Cactus link right here and then find your nearest store or distributor which sells these Cactus version 6 transceivers. That's all for this video and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.